everybody. I thought I would start doing some vlogs. I don't know if I'm going to manage it every day because I have three children to homeschool and a business to run from my back room. Um, but I thought I would give it a go. It's Monday the 23rd, so the first, the start of the first week where we're actually all in the house. We're not in complete lockdown or anything like that, but we've had to close the gym, so we're kind of all there. Um, Dave and I have talked about working out a rough timetable for the kids and for the gym this week. And you can just see him in the background there, bless him, washing up. We were a bit lazy last night. We don't normally go to bed with a dirty kitchen, but it was mothering Sunday, so we let ourselves off. Dave's going to head into the gym today. Um, although the gym is shut to the members, there's some stuff there for us to do. And also, I looked into getting our post redirected from work. And it takes five working days as a minimum and you have to physically go to the post office to arrange it. So we've got to be there as much as we can this week to get the post. Um, I'm going to be home with the kids. I'm going to get them going on their schoolwork and a bit of house sorting. I'll, I'll turn the phone around now and show you what I'm looking at. So, yesterday, Dave and Conrad went to the gym and bought back some essential gym equipment. And what we're going to try and do is create online content for our members um, and also have some stuff for us to be able to train because, um, yeah, we all need to keep exercising. Dave, in particular, will lose his mind if he can't train. So we've got a whole stack of bumper plates. We've got some kettlebells. We've got a flat bench. Those big green squares of dojo matting, and we're going to use those to mat out our back room where I was filming yesterday. More plates. We've got some gloves and some tie pads somewhere because we all like tie boxing and that's good for fitness. Suspension trainer. More kettlebells, some dumbbells. Um, oh, <laughs> That is our Dave's Gym flag banner. So we thought we could maybe pop that up somewhere just so we've got a bit of a backdrop. And if I pan you round without making you feel unwell, we've also got in the corner a 20 kilo bar and a couple of clips. And if I take you into my back room, which is where I was filming yesterday, this back room is my crafting space and sort of a second living room where my son has his Xbox. So there's my sewing table, my machines, my laptop, and there's a bit of retreat stuff and some spinning fibre over there. Um, I have got loads of drying racks for all of the Cartrev yarn stuff. That drawing on the wall, by the way, is when Max was very little and he decided to colour in the wall. You've got Comrade's Xbox spot, my Calax unit, and then over in the corner there, quick scoot past, is some Cartrev yarn, my mantelpiece with my bits and pieces on it, and my sewing trolley. So this is the room we're going to try and convert into a gym. Um, it's got a concrete floor, so that's the best, best choice for that. Um, and as I said on the podcast, I've only recently sorted this all out, so it's a bit sad. But what can you do? So I've poked the kids and we'll get them fed and then out for a quick dog walk before it gets too busy. And today, I thought I would wear my team dog pin from Michelle, who is, well, I bought it from Michelle of the loveliest yarn company. Um, but it's the team cat, team dog pin. And of course I am team dog. Um, it's another beautiful day, so I might film a bit of our walk. So if you are stuck inside, you can have a bit of beach time with me and the kids. Jim the dog. It's not as good as our friend's picture of Jim. Jim? <laughs> I like him here. Me too. To the sea! 
No, I'm not because I'm filming. Good Jim. Right, everyone be quiet for a sec.